I'm Daisy Ramirez. I graduated with a bachelor's in public relations. And at the moment, I am a social media specialist. I have a routine every day where the first thing I'll do is I engage in all the platforms. So I'm in charge of all the social media platforms that we have, which is Facebook, LinkedIn, Twitter, and Instagram. What I do through there is I'm the person behind the scenes. So, you know, somebody sends us a comment or sends us a DM or whatever, they need help with anything. I'll be the person to be in the background, like reaching out to those people. I'll be engaging. So I'll be resharing a lot of content. And then I'll be commenting on other people's posts, resharing stuff from like similar organizations to the Better Business Bureau. So that's what I do first thing in the morning. And then right after that, I work on the content. So all the tasks that we put out every day or like every other day that you see on our social media content, I'm the one who goes in there and like writes the content for it. So the copy is once a month, I'll do analytics. So throughout one of the softwares that we use, I withdraw all that data from all of the platforms and then I go into spreadsheets and then work on the analytics and then we see which one did like the best, which posted the top performance and then which one did like the least. And then we talk about, you know, what we could do better for the next month or what didn't work. So that's part of what I do as a social media specialist. Some challenges before that I faced was definitely trying to get an internship. It was a little bit hard for me because I had to apply to some throughout the semester. And just because I was so busy, you know, sometimes it wouldn't work out or like obviously somebody else got the position. So I think that was something that I struggled with before the federal work study program. So the position that I did get, it was like a public relations position through the California Hispanic Chambers of Commerce. And through that, I was able to do some PR and flyers. I do believe that I learned a lot, you know, just within the four weeks, I ended up actually extending it for the whole summer, which I believe was like completely helpful for me to land my first like full-time job right after college. Uh, I learned a lot of like communication is important. Networking is extremely important as well. And also, you know, I learned a lot of like PR. I started working on newsletters and then some flyers and just, you know, communicating with the Sacramento community. So I feel like it really helped me build more confidence for me to land like my first full time job after college. And they're all amazing people and I really did love working with all of them. They were super flexible and enjoyable to be around with. And, you know, they always brought new positive experiences and they always had something to say, you know, like just professional advice that would help me in my career. So I really do think the California Hispanic Chambers of Commerce for the um, opportunity that I had with them. I just think about it to this moment and I still think like, well, if I wouldn't have taken that opportunity back then, like, I don't know where I would be, you know, like, I'm not sure maybe I would still be applying to full time jobs at this moment. You know, sometimes it's really hard to get a job after college, especially with so much competition. So I do feel like it did help land me and like guide me to the right position just because the federal work study program, you know, I was able to communicate through that internship and be able to network with the individuals where I work now. So I was able to make that connection and it helped me get that job like right after.